Moss to a Flame started in Illuminate about three years ago. It's now been to COP26 and it's come back. Very fitting. We've also grown it into an interactive experience, which now means you can come and colour in your own moth and then see it fly on our immersive dome. When COVID struck, we designed an augmented reality colouring sheet that was for people to do in their own homes that brought a moth to life on their phone. And when we discovered that there was a 360 immersive dome in Plymouth, we were really excited by the opportunity of what it would be like to see your moth in a collection of moths around you. It is just incredible to see what is possible to achieve in a participatory way in this sort of environment. This is a mass participation project that has involved 20,000 people from all over the UK and all over the world as well. So we've had moths flying in from Australia, from Norway, from the States, from all over Europe. It's really fitting that Moths to a Flame has come to its sort of culmination of its project in Illuminate because it all started in Illuminate several years ago. This has been the biggest project of our lives. It's been two years in the making and we have finally got to the end of it. And what we're really hoping is to transform all the moths into another artwork in the same way that a caterpillar turns into a moth. We'd like to see this moth to a flame artwork turn into something new and special. And you'll have to watch this space to find out what it's going to be.